Track 2.16 I've had a few ideas about the book club. First, we need to decide where to have the meetings. When we know how much space we have, we can decide how many people can be in the group. Sure. I thought we could meet in a different member's home each meeting. There are two problems with that. One, parents aren't always happy to have lots of people around. And two, most people live in relatively small homes. That's true. But there'll be several people who can't come to every meeting. But we still need somewhere big enough for everyone. Maybe we could ask the school if we can use a room there. Brilliant idea. I like that. I'll ask Mr Jones. He can help us get a room. So, moving on, the second question is, how are we going to decide which books to read? My mum's in a book club, and in that one, they all suggest books and then vote on which looks the most interesting. OK, that sounds good. But we'll have to tell people not to pick enormous books. Hardly any students have time to read a huge number of pages every day. Hmm. But if we meet once a month, people will have plenty of time to read a book of, say, 300 to 400 pages. I'd say that's an average-sized book. So I think we agree. Now, the final point we have to discuss is where we should advertise the club. I think that's easy. On the school website. <laughs>